Imagine this, you're scrolling through social media, and a beautifully animated video catches your eye. You think, I wish I could do that. Well, what if I told you that you can stick around because, by the end of this video, you'll have the skills to make your content pop and captivate your viewers. In this video, I am going to share three secret ways to create this animation example animation using only Canva. So today I want to walk you through the steps to make your own animated video here inside Canva. Let's start with simple animation technique. First of all, let's go to YouTube video, click on it, and then, once it opens, these are our pages, so you can keep adding pages by just clicking on this button. We're re going to make a simple video. You can can use these same tips for any kind of video you want to make, it could be for your business or even to start a faceless YouTube channel. I'm going to make a short video about a person's day. The first thing I'm going to do is go to Elements and search for City, then go to Graphics. Here I will select this for my background. You can follow along with any background of your choice. Drag the edges to adjust the image. Here, I am going to put a walking person as my main character. For that, go back to Elements and search for walking. Canva has wide variety of an animated graphics. You can select anyone from here. There we go. Adjust the size and bring your character to the starting position. Okay, now it's time to make him move. If you have used Canva before, then you must be aware of its animation on feature. If not, then don't worry, I will teach you. You need to click animate then click on this B icon. Click on the character to animate it as you want, hold your mouse down, and just drag the image you want to move in whichever direction you want it to go. I am going to bring my character from left to right just like that. And you also have choices, you can choose smooth or steady. I'm going to select movement style. Stay like this. I'm going to leave it like that. You can also change the speed and make it as fast or as slow as you want it to go. Now I'm going to click done because that looks fine. Let's level up one step further. This time we are going to make the background move with our actor. To do that, since I am trying to make a consistent story, I will use the same character for the background. Go to Elements and select the appropriate background. I will select this to make it sits in the back. Now adjust here is the main part as you need to drag your background image so that we can pull the image while we animate. Please carefully follow along as shown in the video. Now, I will adjust my main character as for the background. Then we're going to click Animate again and click the B. Now I'm going to click on this background, guys. This time, make sure you select the background, not the character. Hold the button down and kind of drag him where I want him to go. Alright, and there he goes. Okay, that looks pretty good. We'll click Done. I'm going to select Movement Style. Stay like this. I'm going to leave it like that. You can also change the speed and make it as fast or as slow as you want it to go. Alright, for our next scene, let's go to the streets. LS, and we're going to use this city road like we want it nice, and I would like to add an animated car. One looks nice. Now adjust it. I need it in opposite direction. So I will flip now, adjust this time. We are going to use a different type of animation technique. First, click on these three dots and click on duplicate. Now zoom out a little and drive the image. Now adjust the car. So it would look like it has reached its destination. Now here is the main part, you need to put transition in the middle. For that, over to this middle part and click on this icon. Here you will see many transition options. Select the one you like. I will select this match and move and increase duration to 2 seconds. I don't need this part. So I am going to remove it by splitting it. To do that, 
Press Ctrl plus S, now delete the unnecessary part, and it should look something like this since you watch all the way up to this point. I will also share another tips with you, which will bonus tips to level up your animation. Make your animation like this. For that, bring your main character to the video. Now you need to bring it back. We will make one rectangle shape so that our character is not between pages. Make sure you make it transparent. Group the rectangle shape and the character by going into layers. Now bring your character behind the car. If you miss this step, then this trick won't work now. Click on three dots and press duplicate. Go to layers and select the character. Then we're going to click animate again and click the B. Now I'm going to click on this, hold the button down, and kind of drag him where I want him to go. Alright, and there he goes. Press steady. I'm almost ready, but let me first make some minor changes to a transition. Click on this icon in between to canvas. Now let's add some transition. You can choose transition according to your choice. I will choose this for my story, and here is how it looks. Thank you for watching, like, share, and subscribe my channel.